Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. If you are already subscribed, welcome back. My name is Sierra and in today's video, I am going to be running down the basics of digital marketing, explaining to you guys what it is, how to get started and how to set up shop. So if you are interested in making passive income online, then this video is for you. I got quite a lot of emails asking me different questions, some of them detailed questions that I felt like would be better answered on video. So I decided to make this video, hopefully it answers everyone's questions. If you don't know what digital marketing is, it is literally just creating a digital product and selling it online. So I'll explain more about that um, as we get further into the video, but the online world is literally growing day by day. More people are turning to online shopping. Social media is growing rapidly. So digital marketing is a really good way to make passive income and make quick money online. A lot of people do it as a side hustle. It ends up turning into their full-time job and they're able to quit their nine to five. Does that happen for everybody? No, but y'all know I preach consistency is key and with a little bit of consistency and some knowledge here in this topic, you can do really big things with it. So. Let's get into it. So if you're just starting fresh, no social media, no knowledge, you have no idea what this really is about, but you feel like it's something you wanna do, you need to sit down and make yourself a little step-by-step -step sheet here. So first thing you're gonna do is pick your niche. If you don't know what a niche is, it's literally just a category, something that you enjoy. So pick something. So it could be fitness, wealth, lifestyle, cooking, etc., makeup, like whatever. It can literally be anything. You can build a brand around anything but you wanna make sure you put your personality into it. That way you can show people that they can trust you and they'll wanna purchase from you. So I'm gonna use myself as an example. I am in the wealth niche or budgeting, you know, whatever you wanna call it. So for me, I knew that I wanted to create a online budget book for people to just download instantly and be able to budget right from their phone. I had no idea how to do that. I also invested in sweatshirts that I wanted to sell to you guys and just online in general, but I'm not the best when it comes to marketing. And if you guys have been following me for a while, you probably know by now, I give a lot of information out for free, which is probably why I'm not, you know, wealthy just yet. Because people literally charge for everything. Like, ask me a question, $5. Ask me this, $25, one-on-one -on -one coaching is $100, and I'm not trying to knock anybody's hustle, but I always just end up being too nice and literally like giving out information for free and helping people for free, which I mean, it's not a bad thing, but I'm not the best when it comes to like marketing and sales. So that's a different story. Also, don't mind the baby in the background. He does not want to go to sleep. Uh, but anyway, so I do budgeting. You guys already know that. So my stuff would be based on budgeting. So I'm creating a digital budget book that you can download right on your phone, laptop, iPad, whatever. So I say all of that to say you have to just pick a niche, something that you enjoy. If you like fitness, maybe you want to create like a workout guide. You can create a workout guide on the software that I'm about to explain to you and link that to your socials. Build your brand around that and people will start buying that and then you make your money that way. But the cool thing about digital marketing is you only have to make the product one time and then you can sell it as many times as you want. So that's what makes it passive income and makes it easy because you don't have to sit there and keep creating something. You just have to create it one time. All right, so now you've picked your niche and you've figured out what you want to create your brand around. So step two is gonna be create your socials. Now, a lot of people think that in order to do digital marketing and affiliate marketing, you have to have a large social following and it's absolutely not true at all. Let me explain why. So it's honestly best to start fresh. So whether you wanna be on TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, YouTube, Snapchat, whatever, it's best to create a fresh new page for that because once you have your niche, you're gonna wanna build around that. So if you already have a, you know, we'll just say YouTube, for example. If you already have YouTube and you just create random videos that aren't within a specific niche, it's gonna be hard for you to gain followers on that page because the people who are already following you are following what you're posting already. So when you start creating new stuff on a page that's already established and has a niche already, it's probably not gonna grow that much and it's not gonna grab those viewers' attention because that's not what they subscribe for, that's not what they were there for. So for instance, I have budgeting all over my channel, cash stuffing, things like that. I am a person outside of that. I do have a life, I have kids, I do things, you know, I've tried making vlogs, like spend the day with me, things like that, they average not that many views because people are here to see me cash stuff. So it throws the algorithm off when you upload something outside of your niche. 
that's why it's really good to start fresh because you can build that brand and bring in those followers dedicated to that specific niche so if you don't have a tiktok instagram or any social medias that's perfect because you want to start fresh anyway so you're going to create your socials dedicate it to your specific niche create yourself a little bio you know put whatever in the bio and now you've got that out of the way so step three you're going to want to learn the basics you can do all of this by researching online it will probably take a lot longer than if you purchase a course so i personally purchased the roadmap course it is a very in-depth training course it's video trainings that teach you the ins and outs of growing an online digital marketing business it teaches you how to get email leads which is basically where like if you put your information on a website and you get those recurring emails from that place that's an email lead so it just automatically keeps sending you out emails whenever that person uploads anything new or has a new product or whatever so the course will teach you how to do that it teaches you how to create your stand store which is where you'll sell your stuff which i'm about to show you mine so you know a little bit more what i'm talking about it teaches you how to grow your social media it teaches you how to draw your followers in and gain people's attention and retain their attention and it teaches you so much stuff it teaches you how to create the actual digital product that you want to sell it gives you the apps that you can use and it walks you through how to actually do that so a course is in my opinion better than sitting there trying to research because you'll be all over the place and the course is very detailed and it goes in order from like choosing your niche and then you know setting up your socials and creating your shop creating your products gaining followers it gives you tips and tricks along the way so that would be my suggestion would be to do a course now do not be out here getting finagled because there is a lot of courses and people selling things that aren't that great so i took the roadmap course which i would literally give five stars it it's very very good it is an amazing course i also took there's something called legendary marketer that's the seven dollar digital marketing course if you guys have seen it floating around tiktok it is literally you get what you pay for it's worth seven dollars it didn't give me any information i was stuck clueless after i finished it um there's passive profit millionaire simply passive there's different courses that are different amounts but literally think about it in quality terms you're getting what you pay for so if you get a seven dollar course you're gonna get seven dollars worth of information um, the legendary marketing course it requires a lot of upsells to get the information that you need they asked for like twenty five hundred dollars for more information i'm like no just no um the roadmap the one that i took it was 497 dollars, and it literally gave me everything i need to know it didn't ask for any upsells it didn't ask me to buy anything else and you have lifetime rights to it so you can always go back and you know read it again or go through the videos again if you you know need some help along the way so i recommend taking a course but do not just be out here buying those courses from everybody because this is what digital marketers are not telling you so on social media i'm gonna call it a trend because in my opinion that's what it is um, i learned about this whole thing from tiktok and the person that i bought the course from i realized is making all this money by literally selling the course so when you buy these courses you get what's called master resale rights to the courses which means that if you want to you can sell the course to people at a hundred percent profit so these people on tiktok and you know instagram and everything are claiming to be digital marketers but they're literally just selling a course and that's how they're making all these thousands of dollars and hitting a hundred thousand dollars in two months so essentially they're selling you a dream now can you make money with digital marketing absolutely but you have to actually sit down put in the work and create the products that you're going to be able to sell so when you guys see those people claiming that they're making hundreds of thousand dollars you know in five months and all of this stuff yes that's true but they're not making it by selling digital products that they created they're making it by reselling a course teaching people how to become a digital marketer so just pay close attention when you are scrolling and you see these types of videos like oh do you want to make a hundred thousand dollars in two months or oh do you want to make two thousand dollars a day do you want to quit your nine to five job like you guys know i always preach about that that's one of my goals is quitting my nine to five job but i'm not about to get on here and act like i'm making hundreds of thousands of dollars right away from digital marketing like a lot of these people do because i'm not on here 
you know, trying to push a course on people like these digital marketers are. And if you notice, they all kind of do the same thing. Like go to the bottom of somebody's page on Instagram or TikTok and look at their beginning videos. It's going to be like day one digital marketing, day two. Oh my God, I made my first sale. Oh my gosh, I messed up. Is this really for me? Like they all have the same topics, the same videos, the same style. They all talk the same. It's just very much salesy and it's not coming off as genuine. And they're not really digitally marketing. They are just trying to promote a course that teaches you how to create a digital marketing business, but they're failing to make the digital products and actually promote those and sell those. They're just selling a course. So just be mindful if you do purchase a course, who you purchase it from. All right. Step four is going to be start posting consistently. So you guys know consistency is key in my book and I feel like it is in general. You have to be consistent in order to see results. So my best suggestion is once you start your new socials, try to post two to three times a day. This is going to be a lot easier if you're posting on TikTok or Instagram Reels because they are much shorter videos versus a whole YouTube video that you have to sit down and edit. So I would say start up a new TikTok. TikTok is a lot easier to grow on than YouTube because you're automatically popping up on people's pages and you don't have to really go searching for the content. It kind of just comes to you and you can choose to watch it. So creating a 30 second TikTok three times a day should not be hard. Um, if you guys need topics to talk about and things like that, I have a whole list of topics that I can give you guys. So you have to be consistent though. Once you start gaining a, a couple followers, I would say about a thousand followers on TikTok, which is, it's honestly pretty easy to get to that. Even if you're just starting fresh from zero, I promise it sounds scary, but it really is. Then you can drop down to one time a day because once your content becomes very good and interesting, people are gonna wanna come back. So they're gonna wait on that one video to be posted. But step four is definitely post consistently. Step five is gonna be create your digital products to sell. So you have your niche, you know what you wanna do. We'll just say budgeting, right? So you create a budget book, a budget binder, anything digitally that somebody can download. Five steps to you know creating passive income. It can literally be anything. People will literally buy anything these days. So say you create a budget binder. Once again, sounds kind of scary, but like I mentioned, the course will teach you how to create these products. And once you learn how to use the apps that it recommends, it will be a walk in the park to create a budget binder. So um, you'll create your digital products to sell. I would suggest having a low ticket items, medium and high. So you could do like, for instance, I have this 30 day self care challenge here for $2.97. That's a low ticket item. People will buy that. People want to be healthy. People want to have a healthy mindset and take care of their self. That's something that I created. It's very simple, but it's only $2.97. So that's a low ticketed digital product. I also have Ask Me Credit slash Marketing Advice. This is like a one-on-one -on -one email where I'll give you advice to help you build your credit or to help you grow, you know, in the marketing world or, you know, grow on social media, whatever. Um, that is $17. So that's like a medium, but still kind of low. And then I have the course here. So this is the course that I took. I link it in case anybody does choose to buy it. Like I mentioned, it's a great course. I give it five stars. That's my 100% honest opinion. That's a high ticketed item. So if someone buys that for me, I do get to keep that whole amount. And then that person can in turn resell that course if they want to. I'm working on my budget book on canva if you know what canva is it's a app where you can create a bunch of different things logos your digital products whatever it is that you want to create pinterest boards and if you do decide to take the course it will walk you through how to um, grow on all of these social media platforms it has a section dedicated to tiktok instagram pinterest youtube snapchat it teaches you how to create your logos it teaches you how to set up your stand store um, it really does teach you everything. So once you create your digital products that you wanna sell, you're gonna set up your website and your store. So you can use a regular website. I recommend Stand Store because you can link any affiliate items that you have as well. So this is like a one-stop shop for, oops, sorry, I just hit my desk. This is like a one-stop shop for your customers to be able to purchase everything from you that you have. So here is my um, Stand Store. At the top, I have the course, I have my YouTube channel, I have, you know, my marketing stuff. 
credit stuff. This is my Amazon storefront. This would take you directly to my Amazon store. I get a commission anytime anybody buys something from my Amazon store. I have my office essentials. This is my beginner friendly credit card link that will earn you $100 if you um, apply. I And then I also have fashion finds. And then at the bottom, this is like your free website builder. And then if you wanna try out Stan Store. So I'll show you how to set up your Stan Store really quick. So you're gonna go to stanstore.com. It's gonna show you this here. You're gonna put your information in. You can start a free 14 day trial. And I recommend doing that before you purchase it. It is $30 a month, but once you start selling them digital products, $30 will be absolutely nothing to you. So once you put your information in and click start your 14 day free trial, it's gonna take you to the homepage and it's gonna look something like this. So you're gonna scroll down to where it says add product. And then this is all the things that you can do on Stan Store. So like I mentioned, you can collect emails, you can sell a digital download, book time on your calendar. So that's like if you want to do one-on-one -on -one coachings with people, once you get established, you can do that. Um, custom product, an e-course, a recurring membership. You can host a webinar and then you can add external links. So this is where you would add any of your affiliate links like Amazon Storefront. Literally, you can be an affiliate for so many companies, Target, Think about your favorite company, go to their website and apply to be an affiliate. You can promote their products and gain a commission. It's so simple. So we're just gonna click add an external link. So you would go ahead and choose an image here. Um, that will be your thumbnail. So say we want to add Amazon. I would put Amazon's logo there, the title. So maybe like my Amazon storefront, my favorite Amazon finds and then a subtitle here, whatever you want. And this is your call to action button. So you can put like, click me, click here, shop now, go to my page, whatever you want. And then you would hit publish. So once you finish setting your store up, publishing all your things, this is what it'll look like. So for instance, here's the course. You can click learn more. This is everything that's in the course. Sorry, my tablet died, but anyway, so here I just have, you know, everything that the course includes. And then this is just a little about me section. And then I have some reviews there. Um, but yeah, you can kind of tailor it to your own liking. And hold on. Let me go back so I can show you the other stuff. Okay, so then like here I have, click here, takes you to my YouTube channel. So you can link everything that you have. Um, that's the self-care challenge. So so here it tells you about it and then you can purchase that this is the like ask me crediting slash marketing advice so here i just basically explain what you're getting and then you can you know purchase that and whatnot then we have this is my amazon storefront so takes you to my amazon shop but you can just kind of see like everything is all in one place um so that's really nice that's why i like stand store versus like a regular website so that's that. Hopefully this video broke it down for you guys. It's kind of hard to explain everything like in one video. So if you have any questions, feel free to let me know down below in the comments. I try to get back to everybody. And if you're interested in starting, I will have everything linked down below for you guys. Just click on the link that says my stand store and you can go from there. But thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully this cleared some stuff up for you and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.